Could spinach be the answer? Sounds like science fiction, but as Shelley Botop reports in Health Watch, it is the latest convergence of biology and technology. Could a simple spinach leaf be the key for treating some lung diseases? Researchers are developing a lung on a leaf model. In a lab in Phoenix, scientists are turning spinach leaves into high tech scaffolding for tissue engineering and disease research. The scaffold of the plant can be used to grow the cells, but also now all the vein and the stem of the, cell, of the leaf could be used as a vasculature system. Frederick Zenhausern's team is creating a 3D leaf platform. First, they use detergents and a flushing system to decellularize the leaves. You need to remove the cells from the plant, be sure that there is no residual component of the plant, and then be able to uh, bring back all the human component onto those scaffolds. Pulmonologist Ken Knox sees similarities between leaf veins and lungs. Now he's on the team that will eventually put lung cells on the leaf scaffold. So our hope would be that even though we have this model that serves as a platform, that we could take a patient's blood uh, and test it uh, in concert with the model, such that it's very specific to that patient's responses. Okay. Good boy. That could be good news for Jim Franks, who has sarcoidosis. It causes inflammation in the lungs and is one of the conditions Dr. Knox is studying. It's really the dry cough and the shortness of breath, yeah. And it does, it does kick in if I do something really strenuous. He loves the possibility of doctors finding treatments with the lung on a leaf. I like the idea that future generations who have this disease may have different treatment alternatives. Dr. Knox says the team will have figured out how to consistently reproduce the leaf model in two years. At that time, he hopes to start testing therapies in their lung on a leaf. And that's your Health Watch. I'm Shelley Botot, Local 5 News.